Hey students, how you doing? Except Timber is here. That's right. I want all of you to be exceptions this month and I want you to do your very best. You've had a summer. Labor Day is past us now. It's the fall season coming up and um, let's just buckle down and let's really do some great work between now and the end of the year. You've got September, October, November and part of December to do what you can do to move up to a new level or even get out of school. So the more effort you put in now, the more you'll have accomplished by the end of the year. So be an exception right now. Do your very best. I want to hear great things by the end of December. Make it a goal to move up, if not uh, one level, maybe even two levels. If you're getting close to getting out, make it a goal to try to finish and get out. Don't try to do it. Just do it, like the Nike commercials say. Just do it. And um, I know you can. I know it's going to be hard, but um, don't wait until the end of the year and think back and, and wish that you could have done more or that you... Uh, should have done more. It's 2013. I want you to stay thirsty through the end of the year. Be exceptional. Do your very best and great things will happen. If you sit there day in and day out and continually think that you can't do it, that it's too hard, then guess what? You're not going to do it and you might as well pack up and, and do something different. This is a hard journey. It's not going to be easy. There are going to be times where you just want to scream, throw your machine against the wall. We've all been there. I've been there. Um, there are days even still when you're out working as a professional that um, you're just going to get beat up by the verbal abuse you're going to take. That's what I call it, verbal abuse, because you're sitting there uh, and for whatever reason, it's just not your day. So, you know, don't think that uh, once you get out of school that you're going to meet the wizard and he's going to go in there and, and wave a wand over your head and say, uh, go forth and miss stroke no more because um, you're still going to have tough days um, after you get out of school. But guess what? You can do it. Many have done it before you, so you know it can be done if we've done it. So buckle down. Let's start this month off really good. Let's work hard. Let's practice. Make your practice focused practice. Don't just sit there for hours on end and slap at the machine. Focus and do your very best. If you're going to practice for a long time, maybe slow the speed down and work on the accuracy. Don't sit there and beat yourself up for three or four hours on high speed dictation that you can't write. Um, and then leave frustrated. When I practice and uh, and working for building speed or getting ready to ramp up for a speed contest or something, even at the end of my practice session, I always slow things down to something that is very gettable because I want to leave each practice session feeling good. I want to want to go back to the machine. I don't want to walk away from that machine and uh, be frustrated or be angry. I want to finish on a good stroke. You all do the same thing. Always finish on a good stroke. Don't leave the machine frustrated or angry. Feel good about it and um, have a good relationship with your machine. This is one of the toughest things that uh, you have to do, and especially as women, is have a good relationship with that machine. You know, sometimes in life it's hard to trust things or trust people, but you have to trust that machine. And it's going to trust you. So give it your all uh, and do your very best. Except Timber is here. Be an exception. And let's rock the month. I want to hear great things. I know you can do it. You are going to do it. And that's what I expect in here. That's how we roll. And um, let's have a great month. With that, I am out. Have a great day. A great month. Let's go.